Tonight, we are speaking to a senior technician for a local HVAC company about furnace and boiler safety after three family members died from carbon monoxide poisoning. It happened last week in Alpine Township. Aaron DeWeird has been a senior technician for the last 10 years with Vredo Vogue Heating and Cooling. He says homeowners should have their furnace and boilers checked at least once a year, and most times they check systems twice a year. We asked DeWeird what can cause a boiler to leak carbon monoxide. The heat exchangers, they can develop cracks and leak. There are things like poor venting. Um, this is a high efficient model, so you know we're dealing with PVC, but there's other stuff that's naturally vented, and those don't have any sort of safeties on them in order to alert the homeowner that there's a problem. The weird said they typically consider a furnace to be older once it hits 13 years old, but he says they have had systems that are only five years old fail and he reminds homeowners to get your system checked regularly. After last week's accident, Alpine Town Township started reminding people about its fire safety program. The township offers residents free smoke and carbon monoxide detectors. It is recommended a detector be installed on each floor of your home and near sleeping areas. Also, the state health department says it's important to follow manufacturer instructions so you do install it correctly. And like a smoke detector, it's recommended you replace the batteries every spring and fall.